this backpack scratch that same thing I'm somewhere between the real and the fakeness The red pill, blue pill, real and the matrix Tell me what's all the fuss, 175 police Wasting all of the tax pages dollars just to holler at us Mad cause the Benz is hot, the Impala's is flush Nobody bother me when I used to hop on the bus So we started this tour in Dallas, then we did Houston, then we did Austin. We've only been out for three days. I think all of us were equally shocked to see exactly how much support we got from Texas. So Dallas was crazy. Houston was wild. A lot of fun. Bun B came out. Trade the Truth came out. Yo, what's up? This is Trill OG Bun B, Refugee K for Life, backstage at Warehouse Live with the young homie Slaughterhouse, man. Headlining his first tour, man. He came through and did it real big. Me and my little bro Trey had to come by and see him. Shout out to the homie Slaughterhouse, you know, it's, a, it's always a good thing when you can get niggas from different hoods, different areas, different sides of the world to come together. And just a text, shouldn't do shit I was supposed to go, you know what I'm saying? Nah, right, this was a nice day, man. I had a voice back in the city, man, doing it big, representing hip hop as it should be. He said, Who's y'all niggas from coming from? Oh, that's real. 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 Oh, the worst show as far as ticket sales went. So we all pulled up to the venue and the line was around the corner in Austin as well. I think for everybody that felt really, 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 really good. Everything's always drama that comes along with tours. You're dealing with different people's schedules, so different people are hungry at different times. Yeah, so you're gonna run into some problems. Yo, that's my nigga Kino right there. Slaughterhouse, welcome, welcome to our house tour. We just leaving Dallas. What up, Nickel? We're just leaving Dallas, headed to Houston. It's uh, 9 a.m. right, well, it's 10 a.m. right now. Four hour road trip. And we hungry. <laughs> that's how you go for it. Well, are you hey, hungry, Joel? I'm hungry. No, Crooked Eye, are you hungry? Royce, <laughs> are you hungry? I'm fucking starving. I'm Wait hungry a minute, as well. Let me well. explain that. You Keep. know, niggas might think I'm on crack or something. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's that goddamn Michael McDonald. Barry Keller here! That's what y'all doing. So we bullshit. all hungry. Kino is telling us that we I'm are not allowed. Too. It's I'm in the contract that. that we can't eat until 6, 7 o'clock. I'm not saying that. But well, what are you saying, Powder? <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying it. My nigga Russell Simmons. If the bus is scheduled to leave at 9, I would take us wait to 9.15 to eat. What are you so talking about? Happens, because we went to sleep at 5 in the morning. So Basically, we got no, four no, hours no, no, of sleep. No, no. So now what we saying happens. is let's eat before we really get going. Like, we ain't going nowhere. Who fucking cares? Right. Sound check ain't till fucking 6 o'clock. Yeah, but niggas be It's a four hour drive. Oh, it don't fucking listen. matter. It does matter if the group want to eat. It's the group's tour. It's our so, goddamn so, tour. So shit gets fucked up, then y'all be complaining. Well, go get us some food right now, B. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, we done talking. Yo, my nigga, we tried to do this the calm way. Get off the bus and get us something to eat, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> No, we tried to work together. To we tried to. Now go fetch us the food, nigga. Yep. No mail on my shit. I don't know what the fuck Kino was talking about. That nigga was wilding that day. But we ate, though. <laughs> Look what we got to fight for. <laughs> you know, we put this record out, Hammer Dance. And I swear it just came out. It just came out a week or maybe two weeks the most before the tour started. I swear to you not, there was a kid in Houston. He was a little kid. He was directly in the front of the stage and he sung every single word to Hammer Dance, Above the Law, Fast Lane, to the best of his ability. It took me out of my whole mix. I couldn't even perform. And it just felt good to see somebody that young appreciate the authenticity that, that we like to represent. You can feel the, the synergy building. 
I know I said that to Royce. I said, dog, I don't know what's happening out there. Something is definitely happening. And so we look forward to the rest of the tour. Should be a blast. Nigga, I swear to God, nigga. I swear to God. Nigga, I, nigga, I take Illmatic over Thriller, nigga. That's all I like, nigga. <laughs> nigga, nigga had Thriller, and he had one of them double dual cassette box. Remember that boom box with the double cassette? Yeah. <laughs> I put Thriller in that motherfucker and put the tape and the cotton over that bitch and tape Illmatic. Not the cotton. Remember the cotton? Yeah, nigga. Hey, much respect to Michael Jackson, but I needed that Illmatic shit. <laughs> <laughs>